guys. Yeah. Not too confident about the shape of that box, to be honest. I hope it's okay. This box is very crooked. Looks pretty good. I'm so much happier than I was before I laid eyes on this bow. You never really know what you're getting when, you're, when you buy a 70 year old item off the internet from some stranger. It is such good shape. So I got the bow strung up. We're about to take our first shot with this new beauty. I can't believe how good this bow feels. We'll start out here at about 20 yards. This bow is freaking amazing. From 20 yards, let's do it again. Oh my God, I freaking am in love with this thing. The most smooth, amazing bow I've ever shot. Carbon arrows that look like wood. They're not cedar like I originally was planning on buying, but they're straight and very consistent. Every time we shoot and we miss the target, we can't blame it on an arrow. We can only blame it on me. Money. Money. That was good. I'm really, really starting to get this, I think. I'm happy with today's progress. The one time I shot it where I didn't have a camera running and it freaking exploded it in my face. Fred Bear might have shot this bow himself. It was made at the Bear Factory in Northern Michigan, just a few minutes from my house. At the time this bow was made, he was living in a camp on the river, hunting in a lot of the same areas I planned to hunt with this bow. It, it sprang from a hobby in my basement, and we had some real tough going in those very early days. I put a tent cabin combination of 16 by 20 tent, and uh, we did a lot of living right on the trout stream. We lived pretty much on berries and trout that we'd catch, and uh, we really had a ball. It made it to the farthest part of the west coast, hunting black tails in the hills of Oregon. Finally, it made it back home to within striking distance of where it was made. And it just fired its last arrow. It's been that kind of day. Here's the last arrow that will ever get shot out of this seven year old bow. It happened. And it kind of hurt, to be honest, when it, when it happened. Thank you.